Hello there, I'm meteorologist Tony Barlow from the Storm Center. Quiet weekend here in Kelo Land for the most part. So thought I'd take this time to uh, give you a quick tour of the Storm Center behind the scenes uh, at some of the computers we use here in the Storm Center. So spin the camera around here, take a look at uh, the right, far right hand corner of our, our studio here in our Storm Center and you can see uh, the computers that we use. Now we do use a lot of computers in the Storm Center, these bottom two used uh, basically for data. We use these to bring in data that, sh that we show you on the air, so temperatures, satellite radar, things like that are all brought in on these computers and then input it over to our graphics computers that we'll see in just a second. Moving up a little bit, these are, we have three of these computers, they're identical, and we use these to uh, show you the warnings on the bottom of your television screen. They do, for the, do it for the most part automatically. The reason we have three of them is to split it up between the three areas in South Dakota, the west, central, and northeast, and the southeast. So we split that up. So people in Aberdeen, for instance, don't need to see warnings when there's no storms in their area. We'll just run that in Sioux Falls. Moving down to the next computer, and this is what we call uh, our scheduler computer. We run a lot of uh, our graphics on this. They go automatically uh, at a certain time every day, and that helps us really be timely as far as getting our shows set up. Uh, also, these send a lot of images out to the web and to Kelloland Weather Now. So a lot of the stuff you're seeing there is done automatically by these computers. Pretty hands-off for us. Uh, very nice feature for us. Moving out here, we have uh, two of these computers that are identical just about. And these are our fast track computers. We use these to show radar. We have uh, the radar displayed there from Beersford. We could throw that up on the air right now and do some cool stuff as far as tracking some of this light snow we have out there tonight. And then this other one's set for Huron right now. And we're uh, tracking some of these storms up in the east central, northeastern part of the state. And this one is going live right now to Kelland Weather Now. Uh, another cool feature that uh, that we do do to have these live images sent to the to the uh, internet and to the TV. So that's what these computers do. Both of them very useful for us on the air. Then we come over here to uh, our graphics computers, and uh, these are this is the gra main graphics computer. This is where we set up our shows, and you can see we have a rundown here of a bunch of different things. We can switch the order of these things around, but uh, these display temperatures, our winds, and all of our shows. And then this computer on the right, these are two of our most important computers and the ones we use the most. This one here we use basically to make graphics from scratch, and that's another very useful computer. So some of our more elaborate graphics you see on the air we've done uh, from scratch with that computer. So those are a few of the computers here in the Storm Center. We'll uh, continue to keep you up to date with video blogs and blogs at killland.com. For now, from the Storm Center, I'm meteorologist Tony Barr.